Okay, this is uh, problem 3.12, math 154. Um, this one here, I have an example problem worked out for you. Um, <coughs> for A, it asks you to use the given ratios to find the conversion factors of parts A through F. Uh, to convert gallons to quarts, multiply by what? I went ahead and set it up left to right with gallons in the numerator and quarts in the denominator. And the ratio is set up there, I set up a proportion um, to get it done. So to solve for, multiply by what? Okay, so we, we, we go into quarts, so we're going to solve for Q. So I cross, multiply, and divide, and I solve for Q. And in the end, <coughs> I see that I have to multiply by 4. And that's my final answer there. In the B part, they ask you what number, write down the equation. So the equation is going to be Q equal to 4G. Um, the next one here, C, to convert from pounds to kilograms, multiply by what? So I'm solving for K here. So I set up my proportion here for part C, for P and the K, going from left to right, and set up a proportion. And I'm solving. <coughs> <coughs> And I solve for uh, K. So I end up having to multiply by 0.45. Then they ask for the equation. So the equations in for part D, K is equal to 0.45P. Then I look at uh, the next one is E. Go from furlongs to miles. So yeah, I'm solving for M. So I set up my proportion accordingly, F to M. And I go ahead and I solve for M. I have it as a fraction here, then I turn it into a decimal. And then they ask for what you multiplied by, 0.125. Then the next one here is to write down the equation, to write down an equation that represents this relationship. So they give us, they, they want it, they give us here F, it's F is equal to something M. So I take my proportion and I solve it for F. So F is equal to 8M in this case.